In this video, you're going to see how you can use TradingView to screen for and make a watch list of all the companies that currently make up the S&P 500 index. To do this, first we have to go into products from the TradingView home screen, go into screeners, and click on the stock area there. On this next screen, you can see that I've got a filter for a pump right now, which is only showing us three stocks. We need to change this and go back to the default settings and then work from there. So go into filters, click there, go to reset all, and now we have a list of about 18,000 different tickers. If we click here to sell them alphabetically, you can see that we have way more than we need to with the S&P 500 obviously having 500 or less companies. So let's go back into our filters and now start creating our list for just those S&P 500 companies. Filter, changing two settings in here is going to give you all the data you need to know. Symbol at the top there, any, we want to make sure that this goes to common stock. And then the next one we're going to do is click out of here, is go down to the index area, and go index from any and just scroll down here. You can see there's a lot of options in here. Scroll down until you get to the S&P 500. Boom. Those two settings right there is gonna give you your list of companies, 473 to be exact, for common stock that is included currently inside the S&P 500 index. Now, to create your watch list, what you wanna do is control all. But first, before you do that, you have to make sure you all the companies are loaded in here because what TradingView does is they'll load from A to about E initially. So I go control all by clicking in here. I'm gonna scroll down, you're gonna see where the line ends. And if I were to add these stocks to a watch list, I wouldn't get all the uh, companies inside the S&P 500. So we're gonna scroll down until we get down to Z alphabetically, make sure that they're all there. And then we're gonna scroll back up, click on one company here at the top and now click control A or command A to select all. And we wanna add these to a new watch list. So let's first create a watch list by going over to the top right. Pop this little guy open there, go to the watch list here, click there, create new list and go S and P 500. So that the next time somebody says to you, oh, just start investing by looking at the S&P 500 and pick the stocks from there. You can do that and have your list inside trading view here of those companies already loaded and ready to go. Click on save and then go back to your list on the stock screener side, right click, go add all selected to watch list. Boom. You now have a watch list inside trading view of all the companies that are currently making up the S&P 500 index. Scroll through, do your research, read the charts, technical analysis, see what the companies are about. This is all the companies you need to look at when somebody tells you, go check out that index of the S&P 500. Now you have a tidy watch list of where to go and get this data inside of TradingView. And if you like this video and got some value out of it here today, consider subscribing to the channel for more TradingView content, interactive brokers, and overall stock investing with stock option strategies. I'm Andrew. Thanks for watching so much, and I will catch you on the next one.